All right, what is going on guys? It is Munch here. Today I got a brand new Black Ops 4 video for you guys. I'm gonna be showcasing all 100 tiers of the Operation Grand Heist. So I'm not gonna bother wasting time. I'm gonna jump straight into it. But if you guys do enjoy this video or find it useful in any way, if you guys could do me a massive favor, hit that like button for me. If you guys are new, hit the sub button, turn on those notifications. Let's jump straight into it. So as you guys can see at tier, one, as soon as you basically start the tier, you play one tier and you get the new specialist, which is Outrider. Technically old because it is from BO3, but it is the new specialist. We're going to go ahead and check out all of the rest of the things. As you guys can see, just a bunch of stickers and face paints and stuff like that. Um, you don't really get anything interesting up until 10 where you do get this new outfit for Outrider, which looks pretty damn good. I'm not going to lie. We do get some calling cards here, stickers. And then level 15, you do get a new outfit for Seraph, which looks pretty nice as well. Keep on going. And then you get to tier 20, which you do unlock the APB um, reactive camo for the Maddox, which obviously you can use on any other gun if you do have it gold. Moving on, at tier 25, you get the new Cha-Ching melee weapon, which is literally just like a sack of gold coins. Every time you hit somebody with this sack, um, coins basically fall out. Um, we do obviously have some new gestures and stuff like that. Okay, that's uh, pretty interesting. Um, we do, at tier 30, you get a new outfit for Profit, which is obviously called Baller. That's the whole sort of like theme for this one, um, which is pretty damn nice. Um, keep on going, level f tier 33, there's a new recon skin. At tier 35, we get Lady Luck camo. Which doesn't look too bad either keep it going level tier 38 you get a calling card tier 40 you get sort of like a riot police fit for firebreak i thought this was ajax but this is actually for firebreak that looks pretty damn that looks pretty nice um 44 you get combat ready um sticker and then at tier 45 you get a new blackout character which is the warden from mob of the dead off of black ops 2. Um, keep it going you do get a new outfit for zero which is obviously part of the baller theme which is basically green it's pretty damn nice. These outfits are pretty good. At tier 50, you do get the Rampage Fully Auto Shotgun, which is basically like the Spaz 12 off of BO1, I believe it's called, um, which obviously a lot of people have been talking about. Bunch of face paints for Ruin, as you guys can see there. At tier 55, wow, this looks fucking amazing. Wow. You do get the Baller-themed outfit for Firebreak at tier 55, which is purple with basically gold and diamonds on it. That looks really good. That's probably the best one out of all of them so far. At tier 60, you get a reactive camo for the Vapor called the Strip, which looks pretty nice. It actually, actually looks really good. Wow. Um, keep it going. Get a few calling cards here and there. At tier 65, the Baller outfit for Ruin. That looks really nice as well. That looks really nice as well. Nice, like tier 70, we do get a new custom outfit for Nomad. Wow. Where well, he's a cop. Okay, that looks that looks pretty interesting. I wonder if they're going to do something for his dog as well. Probably not. But um, we do, at tier 71, we get a new outfit. Not outfit, sorry, gesture. Can't really see it. I don't know why it's taking so long to load. But we're just going to move on. Anyway, tier 75, you get a new Mastercraft for the, a not the ABR, sorry, the Auger DMR. I knew there was there was always an Augur DMR Mastercraft, but I'm guessing they've just decided to release it now. Um, tier 78, calling card, face paint, stickers, and stuff like that. I'm not really going to spend too much time going over all of those. And um, we get the Baller Outfit for Recon at tier 85, which is basically got all down. Yeah, that looks really nice. Nice one. Nice one, Trey. Um, at tier 90, you get a new camo for Outrider. Um, 95, some calling cards and stuff like that, stickers. And some more stickers, and then at tier 100, you get the new Switchblade X9 SMG. You can have a look at the Blackjack Shop, as you guys can see here. Um, we do have Party Rock, which is the new special order. We do get a camo that was just very similar to the one off of BO2. You can also get a Benjamin's Jump Pack, as well as a Benjamin Weapons Camo that was also on Black Ops 2. Um, you can also, they've added in supply drops where you could purchase a reserve crate and it contains three things. From blackjack's reserves and you can also get a starter pack so for 1000 cod points you get a new um parachute new trail as well as a wingsuit you get 10 tiers and this outfit for outrider which is pretty not too bad um we're gonna have a look at the reserves this is basically where you can go to um buy some supply drops 
and obviously if you do have any of them it will appear there which you you do unlock these through play multiplayer or blackout uh, with the inventory it shows you what you have bought or what you have i got this obviously from the pre-order bonus you could obviously choose it shows you the special orders you have purchased as well as everything that you have got out of the reserves in the last 150 so this is basically everything that i've unlocked and it shows you when you've unlocked it i'm pretty sure they had this in bo3 as well as you guys can see there the sg12 mark 2 but that's pretty much it for the item shop i'm going to go ahead and show you guys some of the weapons and how they've changed so basically if you do have a mastercraft variant for a weapon for every kill you get you get 25 percent extra xp if you do have the variant equipped as you guys can see the sort of difference there i've got the gks mx9 i've also got the icr and um, i don't have the malix one because i'm not a pleb and i did not go and buy it um but you can also go and do it with obviously the other things like the uh, shotgun the boombox um as well but that's pretty much it for the tier list for um not tier list sorry the um yeah sorry the tiers for operation grand heist they say that there's a lot more things to come and hopefully there is hopefully it won't be locked behind um cod points what's also good is that obviously things aren't completely locked behind cod points if you guys do play the game a lot you will be awarded with supply drops that you can basically open you do not have to buy the supply drops but obviously you can if you want to but other than that that's pretty much all of the new blackjack and item shop stuff like that i will have more videos covering update 1.13 on the channel as well so if you guys are interested in that make sure to hit that sub button and turn on those notifications so you guys are notified whenever i do post a new video other than that i will see you guys in the next video peace out guys